Hey guys, it's Sunday, so you know what that means. <laughs> Sunday Night Deep Thoughts, that's where I find a quote that talks about how I'm feeling for the week, and I talk about it. So here's this week's. This week's quote comes to us from the back of this book. My co-workers were in the Hamptons and they were shopping at a gift store and they saw this book and they thought of me and they bought it for me. So sweet, so caring, so loving. So I want to thank them. And the title of the book is Do One Thing Every Day That Scares You. And it's basically a journal and there's 365 different things in here, one for every day of the year. I'm not going to do it every day of the year. I'm going to kind of just mainly do it on Sundays and maybe once another time during the week if I don't have anything to vlog about. So it's very exciting and there's lots of great things in here. And the first part of the book, it kind of talks about your comfort zone and asks you to consider things that you're scared of. They can be big things or they can be small small things. So, and then there's an area here for you to create a list of things that scare you. So, this is my list. Snakes, cause they're gross. Blech. Performing in front of an audience. I used to do it a long time ago. I haven't done it in a very long time. I know I would get lots of butterflies and I would probably shake and sweat and be super nervous. So that's scary. Licking envelopes. I've talked about this before. It terrifies me. Every time I have to lick an envelope, I swear to God I'm going to get a paper cut on my tongue. I hate it. Ugh. Being lonely. Which is different than being alone. I don't mind being alone, but I'm scared of being lonely. Not feeling loved. That's really scary to not feel loved. Thankfully, I have friends and family, so I do feel loved, but I need to feel loved, if you know what I mean. And I haven't felt loved in a long time. Talking to a cute guy at a bar. I have never, ever gone up to a guy at a bar and just started a conversation with him. That scares the poop out of me. Ugh. Traveling to a foreign country where I don't really speak the language. That seems like it would be scary. Alone. Because if you're with someone else, it's not as scary. But to do it alone, that would be scary. Any kind of dental work. The dentist scares me and I hate it. Heights. I am actually scared of heights. And the last thing on my list, there's not a lot of room, so I didn't create a really big list. But the last thing on my list is starting over. It's kind of scary. Because that's what I'm doing. And I think this book will help me. So, it's kind of Sunday Night Deep Thoughts. But not really. It's more of an introduction to this really awesome book slash journal that's going to be good for me. In regards to the quotation or quote for the week, one cannot refuse to eat just because there's a chance of choking. You have to do things in life and take risks. And that's my takeaway from it. That's it. I hope you had a good weekend. Thanks for watching. And remember, daydreaming may lead to reality. Have a good night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Sunday Night Deep Thoughts, that's... Absolute Zero. A climatologist and his ex-girlfriend must fight to survive when the temperature plunges to minus 400 degrees Fahrenheit.